everybody today we are off to Nottingham it's the home of Robin Hood not just that see these down here these cut these caves we're going to be looking a little bit at what they say obviously Sherwood Forest is around and Nottingham um, yeah is there anyway many caves around Nottingham uh, they were created for brewing, storing beers and ales, and they put them in the caves because the temperature was cool all year round. Mm. Okay. Um, so, the under, underneath the modern city of Nottingham is a large and ancient labyrinth underworld, over 800 caves and tunnels and passages cut into the sandstone uh, underneath the city and there's 800 caves so it's in the town it's not somewhere miles in the country and this is inside um, this is inside it obviously this is um, TripAdvisor have done these pictures, so people have sent the pictures into TripAdvisor. Um, when we get to see it in a minute, it just looks like a melted building. You can see around the top it was some kind of dome, or there's you can see what architecture was, and it's been melted. That's what it looks like. I think that one's on its side, but it's got this pillar in there. But, I mean, sorry, I think those are on the side as well. Uh, I'm going past those. There we go, back the right way now. Sandstone, just like the pyramids then. Oh no, it was the war. I mean, considering it's built this long ago, 1250 AD, um, yeah, it's in quite good uh, nick. And here's some pictures inside. I wonder how far it goes down inside. They won't tell us, will they? Yeah, look at it. it, goes down and down. So it says, underneath the modern city, modern city of Nottingham, I was listening to someone today saying how it got its name, but I suppose it's a modern city built on top of an old city. Nottingham is a large and ancient labyrinth underworld with over 800 caves and tunnels and passages cut into the sandstone rock lurk beneath the city and more are discovered every year. So the oldest recorded name for Nottingham is whatever that word is, Tiguru Cobrick. I don't know how that gets turned into Nottingham, which is the pre-Roman ancient British language. It's thought to mean place of caves. The name is still appropriate today and there are a lot more caves underneath the city than in, uh, than in Britain. Nottingham sits on a ridge of soft sandstone hills which in places have been cut out into low cliff faces by the action of the River Lean and River Trent that expose soft crumbly rock is incredibly easy to cut into and burrow. Yes, but they only had horses and carts. So they tell us. Yes, yeah, so like I said, there's this labyrinth of cave tunnels underneath the city and look at the name Tiguru Cobra I don't know how that turns into Nottingham but a anyway, place of caves um, it sits on the sand ridge so forth it says but anyway we'll carry on because yeah, there's always a reason um, I think we've got a little bit more to go so yes you can stop at any time and go over those words or look up the caves in Nottingham uh, you can find your own information about them, but you know, 
Wow, it's amazing they don't talk about these things and they're just as important as the pyramids and all that, isn't it? But anyway, we're going to show some pictures now. Thanks very much for watching. What do you make of this place? Because I see a melted building. What do you see?